<laughs> the sun is waking up, it's a new shiny day. Time to laugh and learn as we sing and we play. Baby Ricky time! Baby Ricky time! Learning, rhyming, always smiling, baby Ricky time! Yeah. Finding out new things every place that we go. The more we learn, the more we try, the more that we grow. Hey, baby Ricky time! Baby Ricky time! Happy hopping, never stopping, baby, baby Ricky, Ricky time! time. That's us. Octopus. Hello, children. Hello. Hello there. Children, you're painting so nicely together. And you painted yourselves, too. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. This is for our friend, an octopus. We're going to visit him and take him this. Oh. Oh. Because you have paint on your hands, there are marks on your picture. You need to wash your hands. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Wash my hands. Huh? I think they look pretty like this. Huh? Rosie, what if you get paint all over your friend? I won't do that. Rosie, be careful that you don't get paint everywhere. Hello. Hello. This is for you. Hello there. Wow, everything here looks so pretty. Hey, what's this? Wow, look at that. So pretty. Oh, look. Oh, no. What a mess. It's okay. It will wash off. I'm really sorry. Now I'll wash my hands. <laughs> Children, it's time to clean up. Let's hurry. You all did a good job cleaning up. You washed your hands, your friend, and everything else, too. You're right! Everything's clean! Come on, Octopus, let's play! <laughs> <laughs> Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Washing hands. Rosie, what do you do after you've been playing outside? I wash my hands! Very good, Rosie. We played inside, we played outside, we played every game we could. And now our hands are dirty and they look like they're no good. How to fix this, what to do? How to fix this, what to do? How to make them good as new. Just wash our hands and clean our palms. Rub, rub, rub the soap in so that not a single spot of dirt is left showing. Wash our hands and clean our palms. Rub, rub, rub the soap in. Rinse with water that's clear and fresh. Now they're spotless. I have dry hands. Mine are much drier. No! Mine are! <laughs> I'm so very, very hungry. I really need something to eat. But until our hands are clean, we can't even have a treat. How to fix this, what to do? How to fix this, what to do? How to Yay! make it good <laughs> you. Wash our hands and clean our palms. Rub, rub, rub the soap in so that not a single spot of dirt is left showing. Wash our hands and clean our palms. Rub, rub, rub the soap in. Rinse with water that's clear and fresh. Now they're spotless. And us. In the forest. Hello, children. Hello. Hello there. Hop, hop, hop. I love jumping. Yes. <laughs> 
so do I. Oh, look. A forest. Do you know who lives in the forest, children? Uh-uh. Who? Wild animals. Ooh. Wild animals. <laughs> Let's go and have a look. Oh, <laughs> you are brave, children. Uh-huh. We're brave. We're not afraid of anything. Right, Chi-Chi? <laughs> Not a wild animal. That's just Crashy. Hello, Crashy. What are you doing here in the forest? Hello. I'm playing with a bucket. And you? Oh, we're looking for wild animals. Wild animals? Wow, I'm coming too. So, children, what do you think wild animals are like? <laughs> really big. Really hairy. With long tails. Wild ones. Really, really wild ones. Okay then. So, where are they? Hmm. Yes. Where do these wild animals live? I can't see any. I found one. Oh, oh, oh. where? Oh. Where? There. That is just a squirrel. Is it really wild? Most huh? squirrels are rosy. Wild animals are not always scary. Really? An animal is wild if it lives outside without people to look after it. And squirrels usually live in trees, don't they? Uh-huh. And that's why it's... it's wild. <laughs> it's wild, but not scary at all. Children, you learned something important today. Not all wild animals are scary. Wild animals. Hello, Pandy. What is that a picture of? It's a panda. And are pandas wild? Yes, they are wild. And they live in the forest. Wild animals in nature, they try to stay out of sight. Out of sight. Out of sight. Out of sight. You can see them in the daytime, but many only come out at night. Out at night. Out at night. Out at night. A cute goose looks harmless walking on the ground when not in flight. But can you pet them? Can you pet them? Can you pet them? No, you can't. Because they are wild and free. They are wild and free. You can look, but... Please, please, please. Please let them be. Rosie, do you know what that is? It's a dog. Actually, it is a wolf. Huh? Do you think a wolf is wild? <laughs> and are elephants wild? They're wild! <laughs> <laughs> I'm wild too! Wild Chi Chi! <laughs> <laughs> Some are cute to you and me, small, soft, and furry. We love to see animals in the wild, and their beauty brings joy <laughs> and smiles. <laughs> Some are cute and cuddly, some are big and scary. So many different animals are wild and free. Some are cute and cuddly, some are big and scary. So many different animals are wild and free. That's us! Windmills. Uh, oops. Uh. Hello, Rosie. Hello there. <laughs> hello, Wally. Oh, hello there, Wally. Rosie, I think Wally has a surprise for you. Surprise! I don't think Rosie can hold all the windmills. What shall we do? We need to share. Here. 
Thank you. What a great idea, Rosie. Yes, one for Wally. Whoa. And one for me. <laughs> Another for Wally. And... Oh. What's wrong, Rosie? Wally has more windmills than I do. It's not fair. Uh, uh, uh. And you want mm. to each have the same amount. That means to share equally, right? Yes, equally. Hmm. Let's see if Wally can share the windmills equally. Yes, one for Rosie, one for me, this one for you, and... Oh... It's still not equal. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Now? No, someone has more. And someone has fewer. What will we do? Huh? Hello there. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hello there. I think I have it. One for Wally. Hooray. Another one for Crashy. Here you go. <laughs> now we share them equally. And each has one. <laughs> well done, Rosie. You shared the windmills equally. And now everyone is happy. <laughs> equally. How will we share the boots, children? Equally. <laughs> when someone has much more than you, it can make you feel... Quite sad, but please don't be too sad When we share things aren't so bad If you share things equally Yes, you share things equally It really is the best way for sharing to be When we share equally It will make us happy It really equally. is the best way for sharing to be Is the best way to be. <laughs> <laughs> Who has the most leaves? Me! I have. And I uh, have fewer. Uh, uh, oh. And now? You still have more. Uh, are we equal now? Not yet. Huh? And now? Now you both have equal. Hooray! <laughs> when we share equally. It will make us happy It really is the best way for sharing to be When we share equally It will make us happy It really is the best way to be Way to be It really is the best way to be That's us! The skipping rope Faster. Well, I'm higher. Hello, children. Hello. Hello. What are you two talking about? I'm better at this. No, I am. I can do this. Well, I can do it like this. You are both very good at playing with a skipping rope, aren't they, Wally? Um, I guess so. Uh-huh. Hey, Wally, look! I can do this! Ooh, do you think I can do that too? Of course you can, Wally. But where is your skipping rope? I don't have one. Here you go. Thanks, Pandy. Come on, after me! <laughs> Do you think that you can teach Wally how to use a skipping rope? Yes, I'll teach 
watch him. Watch. Jump. 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 You're doing very well, Wally. And then you can do this. <laughs> That's it, Wally. Rosie and Pandy, you are terrific at teaching Wally how to jump. But how will you teach Wally to jump over the skipping rope? Hmm. Together? Yes, together! Let's go, Pandy! Jump in, Wally! Uh, uh, uh. I'm doing it! Jump! 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 Wow, great! <laughs> That's great! So tell me, children, who is the best at skipping rope now? Rosie is! And Pandy is! Wally is! <laughs> when we play together, everything works out for the best. Well done, children! Jumping. Jump, 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 jump. Here's a happy rabbit hopping. Jump, jump, jump. And the bouncy ball keeps bouncing. Jump, jump, jump. Rabbit hopping ball is bouncing. Rabbit hopping ball is bouncing. Jump, jump, jump. A grasshopper hops on the grass. Jump, jump, jump. Hops on the path. Jump, jump, jump. On the grass and on the path. On the grass and on the path. Jump, jump, jump. You can jump, jump, jump way up high. You can jump, jump, jump far and wide. What is most important from the start is that you jump with all your heart. Jump, 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 jump. Here's a happy rabbit hopping. Jump, jump, jump. And a bouncy ball keeps bouncing. Jump, jump, jump. Rabbit's hopping, ball is bouncing. Girl is hopping, boy is bouncing. Jump, jump, jump. Hopping now are Tasha and Pasha. Jump, jump, jump. Peter, Tina, Lena, Sasha. Jump, jump, jump. Children jump and grown-ups too. The birds and the beasts all do. Jump, jump, jump. Children jump and grown-ups too, the birds and the beasts will do. Jump, 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 <laughs> jump, jump, <laughs> jump, jump, <laughs> jump, 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 jump. Oi! That's us! <whistles> Seesaw. I wonder who's there. Oh, it's Rosie. Hello there. Good morning. I'm going to play. That sounds fun. What a lovely pink balloon. Thank you. Hooray for balloons! <laughs> <laughs> oh, no! Oh, dear. Never mind. Maybe you and Wally can play together. No, thank you. Hm. Play with Rosie? No, thank you. Well, I suppose you'll both just have to play on your own, then. Oh, what have you found, Rosie? It's a seesaw! That's right, a seesaw. How exciting! Oh. Huh? Oh. oh, it's not working? No. Well, to make a seesaw work, you really need... I know! My balloon! Your balloon. I'm not sure that's going to help, Rosie. <laughs> that didn't work at all. Fine. Well, I'm not playing. The balloon's too light for the seesaw to work. You need something heavy. Like my stone. <laughs> Uh, uh, uh. 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 Oh. oh, 
Oh dear, are you okay? It didn't work at all. Hmm. Rosie's balloon was too light and Wally's stone was too heavy. How else can uh -huh. we make the seesaw work? <laughs> By playing together! <laughs> 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 Children, would you like to learn more about light and heavy things? Yes, please! Hooray! <laughs> light and heavy. Rosie has a balloon. The balloon is light. And Wally has a stone. It's heavy. I can lift a feather easily. That's because a feather is light, you see. But hippos are not. Hippos are not. They're heavy as can be, they weigh a lot. I can lift a feather easily. Feathers are very, very light, you see. But hippos are not. But hippos are not. They're heavy as can be, they weigh a lot. <laughs> Look, now the bucket is light. It is heavy! Oh yes! Now it's very heavy! Now it's light again! <laughs> yes! Really light! <laughs> I can lift a feather! Sing with me! That's because I'm so very light, you see! Hippos oh. are not, hippos are not, they're heavy as can be, they weigh a lot. I can lift a feather or balloon, all right. Feathers and balloons are light, light, light. But hippos are not, hippos are not, they're heavy as can be, they weigh a lot. Quite a lot. That's us. Let's play. <sighs> Hello, Wally. Huh. Are you all right? Did something happen? Yes, it did. <laughs> Wally, hello there. Hello. Come on, let's play. I don't want to. Don't want to? I do with a ball. With a ball? That's great. Let's play with it. We can't. It burst. Oh, it, it, it's so... Sad? Yes, it's sad. It's so very sad. <sighs> Can I be sad with you? Sad together? All right. Uh, how do you feel sad? Like this. Oh. Oh. Wally, can we be sad somewhere else? Uh. Come on! I don't know. I guess I can. Wow! Look! Stones! Uh, Wally! Let's be sad over here. All right. That's great. <laughs> Look. <laughs> Some more nice things. And here. It's better here. We should do some more. Oh, I don't feel sad anymore. I feel good. Let's play. <laughs> Sometimes, when you're feeling sad, it's good to spend time with your friends. They can really cheer you up. Feeling sad. <sighs> Children. 
Why are you sighing? We're sad. Outside the rain, it pours down. Feeling trapped inside, we frown. What to do? What to do? It's all too sad. On the floor, our toys are lying. We only feel like crying. You need a friend close by you. What to do? What to do? Hello, Rosie. Why are you sad? Because I am. Yes, but why? I want to go for a walk. But look, it's raining. <laughs> Are you allowed to play with Rosie's scooter? Did she say you can? I can, I can! <laughs> yeah, you can't! I can! No, you can't! Yes, I can! Rosie's scooter is broken now. Do you understand why she didn't want you to play with it? <sighs> Rosie, you need to tell Crashy why you don't want him to borrow your things without asking, rather than just saying can't. Right! And Crashy, you must take care of other people's things and always remember to ask if you can play with them first. You can't just take them. I can't? <laughs> Can and can't. Such small words are can and can't, and they mean such different things. They mean such different things. If you can, then you can do, but if you can't, then you should not. Always ask if you can do, to see if you can or can't. Rosie, can you eat an apple?
Splashy, can you eat a cube? I can't. What about a lemon? I can. Uh, uh, that's sour. Can I eat an apple? You can. Such small words are can and can't. And they mean such different things. They mean such different things. If you can, then you can do. But if you can't, then you should not. Always ask before you do to see if you can or can't. Always ask before you do to see if you can or can't. <laughs> Hello. Good morning. Hello, children. What are you doing today? <gasps> I'm making a boat. The red ones are mine. And I'm making a house. The blue ones are mine. A red boat and a blue house. Great <laughs> ideas, children. Chimney for my blue house. Uh, uh. Children, how can we decide who gets to have the chimney? I don't know. Oh. First of all, we should find out what colour it is. Okay. Okay. It's not red. No. It's not blue. No. <gasps> Yellow? No. Could it be green? No. It's not black. And it's not white. What, what colour, colour is, is it? it? Well, I think it's a mix of colours. A little bit of blue and a little bit of red. <laughs> It. It's purple. The colour is purple. That's right. It's purple. <laughs> <laughs> oh. But then, who gets to use it? It's yours. No, it's yours. Well, what about... Here. What a great idea, Crashy. Rosie gets to have a purple chimney for her boat and you get to have a purple chimney for your house. <laughs> purple. What's the matter, Chi-Chi? I don't seem to have any purple paint. Rosie, Crashy, will you help Chi-Chi? Yes! First we paint some lovely blue and then we add some red paint to what will happen well let's see a brand new color for you and me ah. look, look at, at what, what we've done, done. making colors is, is so fun first we paint some lovely blue and then we add some red paint to mix them up to get a big surprise because the blue and the red will turn into something new now you have purple clever you. Is it a star, Crashy? No. It's not a star. Then what is it? It is Chi Chi. Is it me? It's Chi Chi from behind. <laughs> I'm a star. I'm a purple star. Mixing 
the colors red and blue gives you something very new. Mix red and blue to have a big surprise. Because mixing blue and mixing red will make something brand new instead. The color purple right before your eyes. Yes, the color purple right before your eyes. Who is it? Hello, children. Hello, Mother. I thought you were going to play a game of tag today. Have you started? No, we haven't, but I am it. No, it's not fair. We need a fair way to choose who will be it. I think Rosie is right. You need a fair way to choose who will be it. Let's use a counting game to see who it will be. Why don't you start counting, Rosie? One, uh, one. I don't want to play. This is silly. What's wrong, Rosie? Did you forget how to play the counting game? No, I just don't want to. You can count up to five, can't you? No? Oh, don't worry. Come on, everyone. Let's help Rosie learn to count. OK. One, two, one, two, three, four, five. One, uh, three, uh, one. Three, three, one, uh, one. Let's start with one bead. Let's start with one bead. Yes, then four more. One. That's two beads. <laughs> <gasps> That's a really good idea to use the beads to help you learn to count. A great counting game and a great way to pick who is it for your game of tag. The number five. One, two, three, four, five. To find out the amount, you should learn to count. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Four numbers are before. After five, there are more. Shout it loud and feel alive. All together. Number five. How many blocks do we have here? How many pictures of puppies are there? That's one, two, three, four, five! A star has five points on it. One, two, three, four, five! <laughs> Come on, boys and girls, let's learn the amount. By using our fingers, we can learn to count. One, two, three, four, five. Let's try that again. One, two, three, four, five. Count along with me. One, two, three, and four. And five. And again. Five. Again. Five. Knock, knock. Hello, children. Hello there. Hello, 
to cheer him up. I can. Let's go and play. No, I'm going to sit right here. All right. You sit there. I'll come and visit you. Knock, knock, knock. Is Wally at home? <sighs> Rosie, you know it's more fun playing knock, knock if the house you're visiting has a front door. Hmm? Uh, Rosie, you can come in. Wally, hmm? why don't you ask who's there? It might oh. not be Rosie at the door. Yes, but I can see Rosie's ponytail. Hmm, that's because the door is a square and it is not very tall. We need a bigger door, a big tall one. Hmm. <gasps> Look, Wally. Rosie has used two squares, and when put together, they make a rectangle. So that's a rectangle? Who's there? It's visitors. Visitors? Oh, it's you, Rosie. Come in. I didn't come alone. I have cake. Who's there? Come in, Pandy. Oh, that's not fair. How did you know it's me? The balloon. To hide the balloon, you need a rectangle shaped door that's even taller. Yes, taller. <laughs> Who's there? It's the bears. We are here. You, you can come on in, bears. Here we come. Here comes the bears. <laughs> <laughs> well done, children. Not only have you learned about a new shape, but you have also cheered Wally up. <laughs> rectangles. Objects shaped like rectangles. Are all around Once you start to look You know that they'll be found Simply look and you will see You don't have to believe me A door within a wall A bookcase Nice and tall A book is a rectangle Even when you open it Rectangles all around Just look And they'll be found this is a rectangle. And now it's a square. And now a rectangle again. Look there. The chest of drawers is a square. Look, the bookcase is a rectangle. This book is a square. Uh -uh. This book is a rectangle. Objects shaped like rectangles are all around once you start to look you know that they'll be found simply look and you will see you don't have to believe me photographs on the wall rectangles one and all pictures hanging in a frame rectangles just the same draw a square and then another side by side and then connect to create a rectangle that's perfect Hello, children. <laughs> Hello there. Hello. Hello. <laughs> giddy up, giddy up. Woohoo. <laughs> Hello. Let's be friends. Yes. Let's. Hi. I'm a horse. <laughs> no. You can't be a horse. I'm a horse. No. I am a horse. You are not. You're not. 
I'm a horse as well. No! No, you are not a horse! We're not friends anymore. That's fine with me. Candy, Rosie, I don't understand. Rosie, do you have a horse? <laughs> and Pandy has a horse too? No. What? I think your horses could be great friends. Why don't you introduce them to each other? What are their names? Their names? Their names? <laughs> My horse's name will be Cloudy! <laughs> and mine will be called Cloud. Candy, maybe call your horse something else so that it doesn't get mixed up with Rosie's. What about Sparkle? That's it. My horse name will be called Sparkle. <laughs> Cloudy and Sparkle. What great names for great friends. I wonder what Chi-Chi has named his horse. Beauty? Pirate. My horse's name is Pirate. <laughs> oh, children, you have given your horses such great names. <laughs> names. So, children, what are your names? I'm Crash. I'm Chichi. Who are you? I am a tiger. How many different names are there in our world? Seb and Sasha, Pete and Pasha. Then a Gina and a Tina and Natasha. Ola, Lola, Nora, Dora, Ella, Bella, Keisha, Misha. Teddy, Tom, Jake, Jack, James and John. Too many names to fit into one song. You already know this one's name. Right, this is Pandy. She also loves to eat healthy treats. You know this little girl too. This is our Rosie. She likes healthy treats as much as Pandy. Mm. That looks like a really tasty treat. Mmm, yum, yum. It's just so good. Mmm, 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 yum, yum. Do you want some? Yes! We must give names to puppies and to kittens. And horses, children too. Everyone should have their own name. Seb and Sasha, Pete and Pasha. Andy, Alex, Anya, Alice, Daisy, Doris, Hannah, Horace. Henry, Hugo, Janice, Juno, Isla, Akbar. Your name tells us who you really are. So sing along and play along with our game. And tell us, what is your name? <laughs> That's us! The Hat Hello, Wally. What a beautiful picture you've drawn. Hello there. Thank you. I like drawing. What will you draw next? Um... Um, uh... Rosie! No, no! Please don't draw me yet! Why don't you want Wally to draw you, Rosie? I need to find something! Oh! What is it? Huh? I can't find it. What are you looking for, Rosie? It, my favourite hat. <laughs> Wally, can you help Rosie find her favourite hat? It's so lovely. Where can it be? <laughs> 
cry, Rosie. I'll help you. Rosie, what does your favourite hat look like? It's red like this ribbon. Oh, I see. So it's a red hat. Yes, I wonder where it could be. Wally, we have to find it. My favourite red hat. It's the same colour as this ribbon. A red hat. A red hat. Rosie, I've found it. Where? Come with me and I'll show you. Wally, where are we going? Hmm. This way. Close your eyes. Oh. Now open them. <laughs> My red hat. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> My favourite red hat. <laughs> Rosie, can I draw you now? Yes, please. Hooray. <laughs> oh, a lovely drawing of a lovely red hat. Well done, children. <laughs> Red. Hello, children. What a beautiful red balloon, Rosie. Yes, it's red. The sun goes down and sky turns red. Beautiful clouds are overhead. What is the colour, can you guess, <laughs> of my favourite party dress? You'd be right if you said that it is the colour it's red. red. Red, like a rose or a funny clown's nose. Rosie, what is that? A red circle. That's right, it's red. Look, I've drawn a red circle too. That's great. Children, what else can you draw that is red? A red flower. A red apple. <laughs> so many things are red, it's true. Strawberries and raspberries for me, me and you. you. What other fruits can you see too? Lovely red fruit for me and you. So what have we found? Red is all around. Just like a rose or a funny clown's nose. <laughs> <laughs>